So did you hear? Everybody's favorite real estate website just admitted their own catastrophic failure. Hey guys, I'm Nicholas Shrouder, one half of the Shrouder Brothers, Berkshire Hathaway, Results Realty. And yes, I agree, it is not very gentlemanly or kind to celebrate the demise of someone else, but this isn't just a someone, this is a something. Don't know if you've heard, but last week, Zillow and their iBuyer program shut it down. But why? That's the great part. So let's dive into it. Let's be very brief here. I'll let you do some of your own research so you don't have to take it from me, a person who is very, very happy this happened, and it's almost like an I told you so, but that's okay. So Zillow, for the past, eh, what is it, about roughly three years, maybe three and a half years, have been offering to homeowners to purchase their homes. They would come in, they would make a reasonable offer based on the Zestimate, of what they would buy the home for. If the seller agreed, then in turn, they would purchase the home, might do some fix-ups, and then put it back on the market in hopes of making a profit. So, what happened with that? They probably did okay for a little while, but in just the third quarter of 2021, they lost, and I'm reading from an article right here, about $304 million. It gets better. During that time, they purchased just shy of 10,000 homes. Now, how many of those homes sold? About 3,000. But why did those homes not sell? Why those 7,000 homes not sell? Reading from a quote from a Zillow executive, we have been unable to accurately forecast future home prices. I believe I've done multiple videos about the home value tools that you can find online. Put in your address and bam, there's your value. One's called the Zestimate. There's some other ones out there as well, but most people rely on the Zillow Zestimate. Not anymore. The proof is in the pudding. Zillow lost their butt on this deal and they are getting out of the home buying business because they didn't know what they were doing and their algorithm of telling homeowners what their home was worth was incorrect. I'm sorry. It, this one makes me extremely happy. When I read it last week, I kind of jumped for joy just a little bit. But again, I don't mean to, you know, to celebrate somebody else's misery, but this is Zillow. They want to come in and try and disrupt the market and you can't beat a real real estate agent. A real valuation of a home, there is nothing else that stands in the, in place of that. It just doesn't. You can't put your, the criteria of your home into a system and get an accurate number. There's too much that comes into play. Now, there's a lot of other sales. There's a lot of other features to homes. That's why whenever you want a true value of your home, you need to reach out to a trusted agent and have them come to your home, take a look at your home, and then go back and do their research, do their due diligence, and then provide you with an accurate value that is not just a Zestimate. So, again, sorry that I'm celebrating somebody else's loss, but it's Zillow. So I'm kind of sorry I'm not sorry. Whatever. But guys, definitely check it out. All you have to do is go into your favorite search engine and type in Zillow, and I guarantee you it'll be the First thing that pops up after, of course, their own website. People are still gonna use the website. I get it. They do great marketing. So they become the top search result when anybody is looking to buy or sell a home. But buyer, excuse me, seller, beware. The number that they give you what your home is worth, according to them, it's probably not accurate. Reach out to us, reach out to your favorite trusted real estate agent when it is time to get an accurate value of your home. Don't short yourself. That's what they were trying to do to many people was short them and then trying to come back and, you know, mark up homes beyond what they were worth and now they're stuck. Guys, we do these videos each and every Monday to try and inform and help the buyer, the seller, the consumer in general, or to just educate and inform of the great state that we live in 
the Sunshine State, Florida. Live flow life. That's what we're all about. Living, loving, and selling the Florida lifestyle. Please reach out to us. Our website, liveflowlife.com. You can watch the videos. You can check the blogs. Uh, there's so much more that you can do on those pages. But please do reach out. Click the like, the subscribe, all of that. Uh, if you have any questions at all, definitely just let us know. We appreciate everything. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a comment. I'd love to know your input on this. We'll talk to you soon. Have a good one.